welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe and enable notifications so you can stay up to date on all my latest content. So this video is going to be about how to deal with challenging Airbnb guests. So if you've run an Airbnb for any amount of time, I've been doing mine about a little over three years, you're going to run into some challenging guests. So this can be anything from just a lot of issues when they're staying or issues before they arrive. So one thing I would say that would help to mitigate some of those issues is just make sure you have a really good communication with the guests um, from the time they confirm their reservation up until they check out. So one great way to do this is through Airbnb scheduled messages. Um, this really helps you stay in contact with your guest and just keep them up to date and keep the lines of communication open. So I've made a separate video about that. So check that out, the Airbnb scheduled messages. And then it's hard to say what type of issues you might come across. Sometimes it's personality differences uh, with a co-host or a house manager or uh, with yourself even. Sometimes it's something being broken or maybe they find something dirty in the house or not enough uh, kitchen appliances or something like that. So the best advice I can give is just be very accommodating to the guest. Um, try to give them what they're asking for unless it's just completely unreasonable, um, but try to be as accommodating as possible and I think the most important thing is to stay unemotional. So as the host, you want to be the steady and the constant kind of support through any issues you might have. So if you do have issues with guests, just listen to their concerns. Try to resolve anything that you can and be very reasonable when you're resolving those issues and to stay completely unemotional. Just deal with facts. If they do get emotional, just kind of let them vent. Don't let them walk all over you or be rude to you because I've definitely had that happen. Um, but just listen to their concerns. Um, and if you can, just do everything possible to be accommodating. Um, if for some reason you do have broken items, missing items, damaged items at the end of the stay, you can always request that those be refunded to you. So say, for example, if your housekeeper goes to clean after a guest has left and they find something broken or missing or damaged, you can request that that money be refunded through Airbnb and you would just go into that stay on Airbnb and it's called request funds. And you would put in the amount that you're requesting and what it was for. And then Airbnb will contact you um, to try to resolve that issue. So I've had to do that a couple times when things were either stolen or damaged. So I will say from a host perspective, Airbnb has been pretty accommodating. I've never really had an issue getting a refund for something um, that was broken or missing. So I would say just make sure that if you're not there in person, that either a video or a picture of what is broken um, is taken so you have that as proof. And if you have any receipts from where you bought that item originally, or where you're going to replace it, you'll need that as well also to get a refund from um, either the guest or Airbnb, however it's decided. So just make sure you keep all that information that you have it close in case you need it um, and just deal with um, any challenges that you come. Just keep the communication open. Try to keep the guest as happy as possible because remember, you don't want to get emotional with them because at the end of the stay, they can write a review and you don't want them to leave a negative review because that could affect how many stays you get in the future. And also, when you have challenges, it's a really good opportunity 
to shine if you handle it correctly. If there is an issue and it's dealt with properly and quickly, then the guest will really see that you're trying to be accommodating and really help them out and um, make their stay more enjoyable. So that can be an opportunity to really prove to them that you, you know, really do care about their stay and that you want it to be comfortable. So let me know what you guys think. If you've run into issues with your Airbnb, if you have some different advice or maybe some different circumstances that you've run into, um, I definitely love to hear about them. And uh, just leave a comment with any questions and I'll see you next time. Thank you.